I'm here at Vita Foods Europe 2018 and I'm joined by Efrat Kat, Vice President Marketing and Sales for Algotec. Efrat, thank you very much for joining me. Thank you for joining us. <laughs> Can you tell us a little bit about Algotec and sort of the, the ways in which you're, you're growing microalgae for the food industry? Yes. Uh, well, Algotec is a company expert in microalgae cultivation. For 20 years we have been studying uh, the microalgae plant itself because it's a very fascinating organism. You know that microalgae is the first building block of the human uh, food chain and it survives billions, for billions of years even before the dinosaurs. And during these years the microalgae developed their own survival mechanism and we believe that the human can benefit from this survival mechanism and this is what we are doing at, Al Al at Algatec for almost 20 years now. And you've got quite an interesting way of actually growing this microalgae, haven't you? Yes, absolutely. We are located in the desert. It's a very, um, it's, it's called the Arava Desert in the south part of Israel. It's a very nice area, very clean air, uh, no industrial zone near to us uh, and it's, uh, it's uh, one of the benefits of the desert that we have abundant sunlight all over uh, throughout the years and uh, you know that microalgae is a plant so it requires a lot of uh, sunlight in order to uh, grow and we are using a, a very nice technology that was developed in one of the universities is in Israel. It's a closed system. It's actually pipes made of glass in which we go inside the microalgae and we control uh, all the parameters of the production, of course, all the equipment that we are using, our food grade, we have all the accreditations, we are GMP facility and our products are kosher, halal, uh, non-GMO verification, we also have organic production, uh, USDA NOP organic production. And the main product that we are growing is the Amatococcus pluvialis, from which we source natural astaxanthin. This is actually the red pigment, the same pigment that people recognize by uh, seeing the salmon fish, because this is the red pigment in the salmon fish. And astaxanthin is a very potent antioxidant. It has uh, proven, its health benefits were proven uh, in many clinical studies. There are more than 500 publications uh, proving the health benefits of astaxanthin. And, but it's a lipid soluble ingredient. And many of our customers want to use it in other delivery forms like beverages, uh, sachets, stick, spa, stick packs and so on. So therefore we've uh, recently collaborated with a company called Sfera Encapsulation. It's a startup company from Italy, but they developed a very nice technology of uh, transforming the astaxanthin oleoresin into water-soluble uh, powder. Which nice about it, it's uh, completely using natural ingredients only and we can uh, supply it as a vegetarian form and um, it's completely soluble and there's no smell, no taste to it. So if you drink it, you actually don't need to mask, fla the, mask it with using other flavors. Well, unle unless you want to, but there's no really need to do it. You mentioned the, the algae growing in glass tubes in the desert, and you mentioned the, the high degree of control. That must presumably be very important for maintaining products that are high quality. Um, what sort of tests have you carried out yourselves to understand your products more and to understand the efficacy that they provide to your customers? Yeah, so first of all, you're asking two different questions. First of all, you, we talk about the production. We control all the parameters that we use, uh, all, the all the nutrients that we introduce into the system are uh, going through very severe uh, test protocols and meeting all our standards. Uh, it takes almost one year for us to approve a new ingredient to use in the in the in the production. 
and it's completely controlled. Uh, all the equipment that we use, uh, food grade equipment, and you know that algae, one of the um, um, <laughs> one of the problem with uh, with algae that it absorbs absorb everything from the medium for which it is gone. So if the medium is not pure and controlled, eventually the algae itself will contain heavy metals or other contaminants that can be extracted and found in the finished product. Of course, no one wants to use that. So um, this is very important for us to control the, the medium and to control the production itself. So this on the on the production side. On the efficacy side, we are um, conducting clinical studies uh, to show the benefit of our product. And, but there are more than 500 publications already published uh, talking about the health benefits of uh, astaxanthin, natural astaxanthin. And we can actually see now how the powder form mixes with water and just how soluble it is. So you see, I don't know exactly how much to use, but I just add a little bit and I stir it. It dissolves very quickly. And oh, thank you. <laughs> you try. So that we can see that it's dissolved perfectly. There is no sort of aroma of the algae, there's no taste of the algae. If I was a brand, I imagine that would be very easily incorporable into my product. That's the whole idea. Thank you very much for joining me. Thank you, thank you for visiting.